Novamaker 3.0.1 Function and Usage Introduction Open Novamaker. The printer setting option will pop up. Select the corresponding printer and click OK. Novamaker 3.0.1 is mainly divided into three sections, print setting, print fleet control, print timeline. The entire UI interface layout is simpler than the previous version. The first section is print setting. From left to right, they are file, copy, mirror, scale, move, rotate, hollowing, dig hole, put on the plate, support setting, auto layout, slice setting, slice out. On the right is the file list. Now we will mainly explain the support setting and slice setting. Support settings are mainly divided into auto generate supports and manual editing supports. According to the model's size, you can set thin, medium, and thick support in the support tree type. Click Auto Generate Supports and Novamaker will generate support for you. Confirm Support Settings. You can also manually set the suitable supports. The minimum support contact point is optimized from 0.4 mm to 0.26 mm. Slice Setting. The new version adds transition layer quantity in the slice setting, which reduces the risk of model delamination. What's more, version 3.0.1 optimizes the lifting speed and lowering speed from the initial 120 mm per minute can be accelerated to 360 mm per minute, which can greatly shorten the printing time. This printing uses tough washable resin. Next, set the printing parameters and save it. You can refer to the table above to set the corresponding printing parameters according to the resin used. The second section is print fleet control. After connecting the printer to Wi-Fi, click add new printer and enter the printer IP address and click OK. The left part is the printer management list, which can connect and control multiple printers at the same time. The middle position, Print Files, will display the internal files stored in the printer. On the right, you can see a preview of the print file. The areas below are platform control and basic information of print files. Find an idle machine and click to upload files. Select the CWS file you want to print and open it. Wait for the blue progress bar at the bottom to finish loading. Find the file and click to start printing. The third section is Print Timeline. The Print Timeline section can view the current status of the printer, the number of print tasks, printing progress, and printing duration.